Joining us now, Wahid Nawabi, CEO and Chairman of Aero Environment, a defense contractor whose stock is up 15% so far this year. Wahid, it's so great to have you on the show. Welcome. Great to be with you, Morgan. Now, you also had record earnings last week, and I want to get to those. But first, given the fact that AeroVironment is a maker of drones and unmanned ground vehicles, and, and you specialize in autonomy and robotics, and you're on the edge of artificial intelligence and some of these new capabilities and applications, this technological decoupling between the U.S. and China amid this great power competition, I want to get your thoughts on it. Sure. So, uh, obviously, it is a great power competition. It's very strategic to U.S. Uh, uh, future national security, as well as our economy and our way of life in general. And uh, we are a firm believer that uh, unmanned systems, including with AI, autonomy, software analytics, uh, and computer vision, is going to play a vital role, if not the most important role, in helping U.S. Uh, keep the, its lead uh, in, uh, and protect its interests globally. So what does that mean in terms of air environment specifically? Uh, you talked about it on your earnings call last week, this inflection point of a new phase of growth. So the last fiscal year, which we just ended in April uh, of this calendar year, uh, was a record year for us, record in terms of uh, six consecutive year of top line growth, or as well as really, really a strong backlog. Uh, over $400 plus million worth of backlog sets us up really well for another year of record growth this year, organically. Uh, we guided this year that we're going to grow between $630 and $660 million on top line revenue. And obviously, that is going to uh, add about um, $100 plus million worth of adjusted EBITDA to our bottom line. So for us, because we're an unmanned, purely unmanned systems uh, player, everything we do is unmanned from the ground, maritime, to stratosphere, and even to space, where we des help design the Mars helicopter. We're all about autonomy, AI, unmanned systems to help our warfighters, as well as our civilian and uh, non-military customers, proceed with certainty.